If you want to master your FOF creative icon, make sure you check out our Embroidery Essentials online course where you're going to master 15 different embroidery techniques that will take you and your machine to whole new levels. We've got links below this video for you to check out this amazing online course. So in this video, we want to talk about how we can take lettering, enter it in and have it appear on the screen and then go back and edit it. A lot of times people look for a function, but it's slightly hidden. So here's the trick. So I've touched the A on the side and let's just pick a font. Up will come the keyboard and just for today, I'm going to just type in A, B and C. Now when I touch OK, well, you don't see it because this entire screen is covering it. So just touch the green A to kind of collapse that away. Now, let's say you wanted to add a couple letters or you realize that you uh, spelled something wrong or instead of straight, you decide that you want it on a curve. So when you open the edit box, you think, oh, it should be in here somewhere, but it actually is not. What you need to do, if the design is not highlighted, touch it so the box is around it and then touch and hold. At this point, the very first option says edit embroidery text. That's what we're looking for. And just a reminder of what you get when you touch and hold on a design, you can duplicate it, you can uh, mirror it, you can turn a grid off or on, you can delete, delete everything that's on the screen. Uh, you can read about this part of the machine or even reset the toolbar. So if things have kind of moved around on you, you can get it to come back into place. Okay, edit embroidery text. So at this point, you could delete out a letter, change the letter to something else. And then, like I said, maybe change the baseline. So maybe you wanted it to be a little bit more curved or a gentle curve the other direction. So you can actually go in and spread this out. Now once you're here you can also though go in and play with some of the justification. So you can also add some spacing between the letters. You can move them all to one side. There's lots that you can do or even space it out uh, all the letters across the um, bar by itself. So when you get it just right touch OK and then you can see your newly edited alphabet.